Hydro Hotel is all the best. Oh, it's no use. I'll need to keep this off and start again. Look at me, it's too red. I look as if I've been dooting for chips. Leave it, it's fine. You look great. You know, I've been wondering, do you think I should get my face lifted? <laughs> Probably be cheaper getting my body dropped. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, I'm so nervous. I've never done a show like this before, you know. <laughs> just you relax. There's nothing to it. <laughs> but it's live. Look, it's just a hug money show. Ask yourself, how bad can it get? <laughs> oh, did you see last year's? <laughs> <laughs> well, I have to stand by in the green room, please. Oh, yeah, oh, right, Nina, right. I can have you on set right away. Oh, on air in two minutes. <laughs> Can we go by a green room, please? Yeah, a no, I'm sorry, there's no time. Hey, Malky, how are you doing? Hi, girl. Hello. Well, this is it. Another opening, another show. Tonight, the Hedrum Hydro. Tomorrow, Caesar's Palace. Hey, have you heard the one about the postman and his beat doing Lover's Lane? Aye. I tell you, about half an hour ago. Is that right? See, that's the trouble with jokes. By the time this programme goes out, everybody will have heard. What do you mean? This programme is getting transmitted. Next year, isn't it? <laughs> Get serious, Malky. This is live. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Are you telling me that when I go in that room there and do my act, that my dial is going to get picked up with a camera, shoved through miles and miles of cables, beamed out of the transmitter master, blasted out across the airwaves at exactly the same time, so that when I stare into the camera, Everybody in every house in Scotland is going to be staring back at me waiting to see if I make a total prat of myself in front of the whole country. In a nutshell. Aye. Well, that's ridiculous. Doesn't make sense. Tell us about technology. Microchips. Videotape. If you make a mistake, you just do it again. The punters are none the wiser. <laughs> I've never done live telly in my life. Thought I'd be out with Dixon and a Doc Green. I'll be here to do that, right? Yes. Now let's just wait a minute. Can I just check out that thing about the gun? Everybody ready to go? Yeah. Good. Well, that's us on the last ad, so good luck, everybody. All the best. And remember, this is our chance to put the station on the map. Live outside broadcast, satellite link, alternative comedy. Wow. We're going to say farewell to all those tacky, tacky Heather Hay bills and who's your fell shows, Jimmy, once and for all. Let's show the opposition what a Hogmanay show's really all about. Right. Here we go. Master control. Have it. This is the Highlands and Islands Broadcasting Service. Now it's time to back open it in a short breed. Pick your feet up and pour yourself a dram as we go live to one of Scotland's top hotels, the Hedrum Hydro, where your host Ginny Boaty and Selina McGuigan are waiting to bring you all the best. Cue the back. <laughs> Not to can see. everybody and a hundred thousand welcomes, or as we say up here in Glen Campbelly. Cade Milafolcha, we're coming to you live tonight from the Hedrum Hydro, just outside the historic town of Kirk Douglas. I'm Johnny Beatty. And I'm Selina McGuigan. We'll be your hosts for the rest of the night. And what a show we've got lined up for you, Mayor Talent, and a Saturday night at the Lacan. And who better to kick us off on the right foot than the Bunty McArdle dancers? <laughs> as they step on the road to the aisles. <laughs> I'm going to lighten up the proceedings, eh? <laughs> All the best, boys. That's right, son. Crap. Arthur, oh, so behave yourself. Oh, our host and hostess. Please excuse our late arrival. It's my fault, I'm afraid. I simply couldn't tear myself away from the promised ball. Oh. Never seen it, what? You, uh, you have kept that quiet little table by the window for us, haven't oh, you? Oh, sure, oh, sure, oh, definitely. I made sure to name the plank of jacks at that table till you go here. Much appreciated here. Let me give you something for your trouble. Well, you've got some Sloan's liniment off a of bottle of romantics. I'll do the mansion. Oh, I see what you mean. No, thank you very much. 
very obligated, I'm sure. Now, if you'll just follow me. Mummy? This is the way to see out the old and see in the new, quietly and expensively, surrounded by... Thank you. Oh, these people. And now, for all you youngins, you're about to go prospect and leave your mummy and daddy your own. A big hand for the Hump family! <laughs> The poor phrase that's going to describe Wind and the mist and the fill of the tide Seven wave and the moon's first ringing How sometimes I know some things I want a phrase to say you had a good time Song be sung and a finish your wine Better smile and I still it on So crash where you can and the rest go home Friends. And we have to won't happen again But I think of what you're seeing is the things I have to do To earn enough to the keep it all with you I'm gonna stay up late and I'm gonna drink I'll be on my own when I need to sink As the night goes tired, I'll load it Don't get sad about life, I've been like the moon It's a rattle, it's a rattle It's a rattle of a simple man Comes from battle It's a rattle of a simple man It's a rattle, it's a rattle of a simple man Johnny, it won't be long before the bell. And to take us there, a song that our next guest has made on her own. We bell our frogs, really. I'm only kidding. <laughs> Here she is, the talk of the Stevie herself, Elaine C. Smith. <laughs> It just slipped away And all is all it makes you We wish you all You wish yourselves Let's put the past behind us We wish you health And we wish you wealth Though it's no been known To find us Oh. 
dry seat in the house. Well, it's getting near midnight, ladies and gentlemen, so let's get our glasses ready for a traditional nerdy toast. Aye, listen, if you're on your own or you're far away from home, why don't you join, join us in bringing in the new year? <laughs> Preferably with a wee or a... With the whiskey! Wee Fiona! Get them some! <sighs> well, really? <laughs> oh, there we are, then. Saved by the bells. Speaking of which, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, a happy new year! Happy new year! Happy So what happened to the whiskey? I'm sorry, of course, dear. Just get on the ball, grab it, kick it into touch. We've still got another hour of this stuff to go, so no more surprises. Right. Right. Oh, and by the way, yes. all the best. Between my lips, between my gums, look out, belly, here she comes. as they get their necklace cap and do the Angus off the rollies back then. There's a shop that Daddy Bocco and Nick Lowen sipping brews and playing fever for the while. As he burns the wall like Peary's or a wee of white Malirius who can take to put the kettle on the belt back. Right. Just a minute, just a minute, Johnny. There's a lot of people out there aren't going to understand a word you're saying. What is it they don't understand? Whackling hay. Mean staggering home in Octor Monkey. <laughs> and a haggis. That's a pudding kind of thing. Because it's feeling so from scalping. Which means stacking with an extra Scotty sink. <laughs> Teddy Bogle. Ah, that's a scarecrow with a heebies. And the top spins like a peary. Is that so? Well, I just have one more query. Tell me, what's a wig maleary? It's something that you wouldn't want to do. <laughs> On the next we're back on him, they often must be. On the road, I often see the blue grain. On the haggis, as a young man, 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 as a Anything he's need, like a... Uh... Like a... Maybe a wee sandwich. Oh. Or a Paris bun. And a wee something left over the Do you have a good here. cuisine? Hey, What's your cuisine like? Oh, no, no, no. I, I can do your frog's legs, but with the... With no cuisine. Thank you very much. Well, you know, there are many streets in television. There's Coronation Street, there's Sesame Street, but here's Scotland's favourite street, Danny Street. Let there be you, let there be me, let there be oysters, 
way under the sea Let there be wind And occasional rain Chili con carne Sparkling champagne Let there be birds To sing in the trees Someone to bless me Whenever I sneeze Let there be cuckoos A lark and a dove But first of all, please Let there be love mm -hmm. Love Gonna be fine. Just like playing a club, that's all. Only instead of fifty punters, us. <laughs> millions and millions. We go long harmonizing a song, or I'm reciting a poem. I'll go by and they give you the eye, walking my baby back home. We stop for a while, she gives me a smile and snuggles her head to my chest. We start to pet, and that's when I get her powder all over my vest. After I kind of strength my tie, she has to borrow my comb. One kiss, then we continue again. I'm walking my baby. My wonderful baby Yes, I'm walking my baby back home I wonder will you two be somewhere? Ah, you should do. We used to be in the stage ourselves, didn't we? Where? Do you know what we were? We were Scotland's Valentine's of our eyes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi, but that's before your time, son. Oh, hi. I'll tell you something. We toured with all the musicals, but that was in the good old days. Like what? Like lilac time. Do you know, know that one? Sure I do. We'll gather lilacs in the spring oh, again. Goodbye, Hokey, you know your stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boys, <laughs> there, oh, boys. <laughs> And we, we also were in the desert song. Do you know that one? Oh, I want alone to be my own. She knows that. She knows that. She knows that. And then after that, we did No No Nanette. No No Nanette? Aye. Ah. Aye, ah, do you know No 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 Nanette? <laughs> <laughs> she played Nanette. And every time I went near her, she shouted, No, no! Oh, <laughs> Carol Kidd, please! Oh, good luck! Oh, All the best, Carol! All the best to you, Hen! All the best! All the best! Good luck, Hen! <laughs> now remember, it's the start of another year. So don't drink and drive, because you'll spill it. Don't let the guy driving home here drinking my dark wet night and he's all over the road and the policeman stopped him. He said, Are you the driver of this car? He said, Well, it's automatic, but I've got to be here. <laughs> the said, Oh, you're a clever guy. A clever guy. He says, well, I'm no standing out there in a puddle. <laughs> People said, blow into this bag. He said, what's the matter in here? Chip's too hot. <laughs> <laughs> the policeman said, have you never heard of the wee bag that gives the show away me? You'd have been too much to drink. You've never heard of it. I'll get it. Fiona, don't let that brat out of your sight. With power. Come to pieces, I shall. Yes. And now, a really special treat. Singing a song by Henry Mancini, Britain's first lady of jazz, our very own Carol Kidd. <laughs> Not often we reflect upon the good things, and those thoughts always center. And for 
have made me so very happy. A wee Kaylee, and I'm sure you all know what a Kaylee is. In case you don't, a Kaylee is a distillery set to music. <laughs> now you can be sure all over the country just now, Lauder songs will be getting loud in. Here tonight on our show, with his tribute to the great Harry Lauder, please welcome Tom Watson. <laughs> He's our pride and joy, and a bonny, bonny boy. And his father and his mother beat the door But mind I'm telling you He loves the lassies too Just the same as his father that the four I'm a ha 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 a boy Here lassie I never never worry And I never never grieve I take things very easy what a canny take, I'll leave. I'll work the hay week through the early morn till late at night. And it's Saturday, I always look forward way to luck. A beautiful Sunday. Oh, I wish it would never come Monday, but I'll lie between the sheep, my bed at door. Oh, it's very nice. Yes, it's very, very nice to get your breakfast in your bed on Sunday morning. <laughs> yeah. What joy, what great delight it is to hear the church bells ring. I wouldn't miss their welcome sound, no, not for anything. When they begin to ring, I rise and go. Of a week, he came in the <laughs> and I felt loose like rain. I just filled my pipe and left it. Then I go back to bed again on beautiful Sunday. Oh, I wish it would never come Monday, but I lie between the sheets, my bed at all. Oh, it's very nice. Yes, it's very, very nice to get your breakfast and your bed on Sunday morning. Beautiful Sunday. I wish it would never come Monday, but I lie between the sheets, my bed and morning. Oh, it's very nice. Yes, it's very, very nice to get your breakfast and your bed on Sunday morning. Oh, it's very nice. Yes, it's very, very nice to get your breakfast and your bed on Sunday
drift away But I've been telling old stories Singing songs That make me think about where I came from That's the reason why I seem so far holiday by phone, cut out the travel agent and saved him up to 15%. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I thought I'd get a pat on the back. <laughs> but he only went and shut my head in the car door, didn't he? <laughs> Why travel agent when you can travel direct? Good point. I don't suppose you have a copy of Fly Fishing by J.R. Hartley. Cousin. Hello, you know the Hornby double armored railway? Do you have an R186 signal box? Ted should be taking it easy at his time of life, not working himself to the bone. Unless for the gun. You can't possibly wear that old thing. You must buy a new one. You're right. Good old yellow pages. We're not just there for the nasty things in life, like a leaky roof. We can help with the nice things, too. You do? Oh, that's wonderful. Uh, can you keep it for me? Great! You got one, Mum. I'm looking for a Panama, size seven. You have, Mum. Would this be any use? Oh. Good old yellow pages. My name, oh yes, it's J. R. Hartley. All over Britain, people are waiting for the Reader's Digest record payout prize draw. When the draw takes place, someone somewhere is going to win the first prize of £200,000. And that lucky person could be living in your television area. But hundreds of other people are going to win cash prizes. So if you receive some prize draw numbers, return them immediately. Because the sooner you enter, the more you could win. seldom this excited. New Pedigree Chum Select Cuts. Pedigree Chum Nourishment in juicy, meaty chunks. Now Hobson has a choice. Welcome back. And we're delighted that our next guest can be with us tonight. Someone who's been called... Well, he, he will wear the coat, that's what he's called. The Voice of Scotland. Ladies and gentlemen, Kenneth McCallum! <laughs> Over the years, I've written a few songs about Scotland, you know, the Royal Mile and the West Highland Way, even the Midges. But I've always hoped that one day I might be able to write something very emotional that will bring a tear to your eye. And I think I've cracked it. So here it is. My granny had a sweet tooth, the only one she'd got, a monument to local sweetie shops. Although her life was dreary, she managed to be cheery after 40 years of sucking lemon drops. She favoured dolly mixtures for an evening at the pictures I know for sometimes she took me along I would sit upon her lap, share a sugar alley strap And going home she'd sing this song Give me a pan, drop 
a pandra, the thing that's made me what I am today. It's strong, it's white, it tastes just right, it chases all the nasty smells away. I need a pandra, a pandra, I need it now when I will tell you why. For besides my Adam's apple, a pandrapple wet my thrapple, and it always puts a twinkle in my eye. The day that Granny died with a family by her side was a day we all remember on our street. She had had some ginger fudge, and as far as we could judge, it seemed that it was going down a treat. But then we heard her groan. Halfway through a Toblerone, a toffee apple dropped upon her chest. It was then we feared the worst, for our bubble gum had bust. But I still recall her last request. Give me a pan, a pan, the thing that's made me what I am today. It's white, it tastes just right, it chases all the nasty smells away. I need a pan, a pan, I need it now, and I will tell you why. For besides my Adam's apple, a pan drapple wet my thrapple, and it always puts a twinkle in my eye. Yes, it always puts a twinkle in my eye. ever get the feeling that your man doesn't appreciate you? Well, this next ditty is just for you. Written by Peter Nardini and sung for us tonight by that gorgeous Detective Sergeant Mike Jardin, alias James McPherson. <laughs> I love the way you press my shirts I love the way you drive me nuts I love the way you bum my toast I don't mind the time that's lost Even though you're always late I think you're great I think you're At times I have a notion to play all night, sleep all day Or else I'm in a rotten mood, sit about the house and brood Amazed at what you tolerate, but I think you're great <laughs> Sorry, but you must be quiet. You might no be a beauty queen, you're slightly mere than seventeen. You're no exactly skin and bone, no wouldn't hurt to lose a stone. But even though you're overweight, I think you're great. I think you're great. Hi, boys. Hi there. I see the lassies in the street and some are really pretty neat But you may need to worry hen for I've no time for any of them Don't get yourself into a state Cause I think you're great I I go into a gallery and see the paint is on display To understand the work of art, I must open up my heart So I don't appreciate, but I think you're great I think you're great 
The singing policeman. Now Christmas may be over, but one Carol lingers on, and I think she's great. Please welcome back Carol Kidd. <laughs> Rock your by your baby to a Dixie melody when you croon. Come on and croon a tune From the heart of Dixie Just hang that cradle man in mind Out on that Mason-Dixon line And swing it from Virginia To Tennessee with all the love that's in Weep no more, my lady, won't you sing that song for me? Soft and low, just as though you had me on your knee. Da, 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 da. A million baby kisses I'm gonna deliver. The minute that you sing that song, I want them Rock-a-bye, you rock my baby To a Dixie melody rock by rock by my baby To a Dixie melody When you croon, come on and croon a tune From the heart of Dixie just hang my cradle, sweet mammy, mammy, mine Out on that Mason Dixon line And swing it from Virginia To Tennessee with all the love that sing We need no more, my lady Come on and sing that song for me Soft and low, just as old Through the miracle of modern technology, we are going live by satellite all the way to Australia to see how the cast of Home and Away celebrate Nair Day Down Under. Everybody that was on until after the commercial break. They've all gone. Well, get Selena to improvise. Say something. Anything. Okay. Just say anything. Okay, right, I'm just going to cure you. Just clue her. Wow. Well, <laughs> looks as if we've... Got a few gremlins in our satellite link up. <laughs> Last time we buy our equipment from Dixon's. <laughs> so, uh, in the meantime, I, I thought I'd tell. Uh, I thought I'd tell you about uh, the operation that my auntie Isa had earlier on this year. It, 
Mrs. Lippett. He can have two or three on her legs, you know. And I can't watch any more of this. This show is dying in its feet. You should get big Malky on. At least he gives a laugh. Uh, where is he, by the way? Nobody's seen him since we started. Oh, don't tell me. But we better go and find him. Carol, you stay here in case he comes back, right? He found this penny. Grisly lump. Oh, my God, that will all have to come away. Fiona, please get somebody off my guns! I'm on my own here. I'll need to go and find everybody. It's going to be fine. It's just going to be fine. Either. Well, she got her brain. What'd you cry? Her feet dead. Is he in there? No. Thank goodness for that. Now get Selena to introduce him and save me from Aunt Eliza and her festering arm. That's all right, son. She's just doing you worry about it. Can you have a God's sake? I've got no answer. That's how important it is. Well, that was a creepy story. <laughs> and I'm sure there's a, there's a lesson there for all of us. But uh, right now, I'm glad to say that our next artist is here, live and ready to go. So please welcome back Kenneth McKellar and the Saturday Dance. <laughs> Sheer power. Others prefer more refinement. Yeah. Happen. 
luckily, you can now have both. The 16 valves Renault clean. Rosé, refreshingly light. Uh, Jeremy was here to tell you about his spot problem and how he used these new Biactol pads daily. They have a rough side which scrubs your face really clean, opening the pores so the lotion on the smooth side can get deep down to kill bacteria. Jeremy has found the effect of this unique double action startling. <laughs> New Biactol Double Action Pads. They laugh twice as loud in the face of spots. Britain's biggest furniture sale. Featuring the new Hygiena Kitchen Collections. Including all the new styles for the first time in any sale with up to 75% off. Plus a huge choice of Hygiena bedrooms with discounts of up to 50% off. It's all at the MFI sale. I want you to get me a Burger King flame grilled hamburger, fries, and a large Coke. You got it. You want a hamburger flame grilled? You got it. You want a Whopper? You got it. You want chicken flame grilled? You got it. A double cheeseburger with bacon? A real Coke? You got it. You want a spicy bean burger? You got it. You want breakfast? You got it. You want him to do it again? You kidding? As they say, BK, you got it. Book your summer holiday at Pickford's Travel now, and there's up to £275 off for two. Up to £275 off at Pickford's Travel now. I've just been out with an old flame, Ulrike, my uh, little German dentist. Oh, it was five years ago she fixed my crown, took her out for a drink that same night. Gee, seeing her again has brought back all those old feelings. Part three. And we hope you're still in party mood. Yes, because we've got quite a party going on here in the beautiful Hedrum Hydro. So please let's have a nice big one welcome for our next party guest, Barbara Dixon. <laughs> I 
the Colosseum Dodge and lions And I'm wasting time All those mighty kings of the jungle Like the hardly stand to see them Yes, it sure has been a long, hard time Train wheels running through the back of my memory When I ran on the hilltop following a pack of wild geese Someday everything's gonna be smooth like a rhapsody Dylan's song on the Hogmanay show. When I paint my masterpiece, and our thanks to Barbara Dixon. Now, please welcome back the Bunty McCardle dancers as they step out with the deal among the tailors. <laughs> Bloodletting. Smoking Maguire. Oh. Nice. Is he ready? I don't know. I haven't seen him. Oh, you better get your skates on, darling, honey dove. He's on next. On the way. I'm being punished for something. I don't know what it is I'm supposed to have done. But it must have been very bad. It must have been very, very bad. Thy BAFTA hello late call in Gaelic. Come on, son, you you need to sit down for a wee minute. Don't you get there? Uh, I'm all right. You sure? I'll be hunky dory when I've had a bridey. Oh my God, is he no well? Aye, there's no well as a newt. Do you know where we found? Do you know where we found him? In the kitchen looking for a bridey. Oh, what am I going to do? I'm supposed to look after the artist. It's all my fault. I'm for it. I'm going to get my daughters. I'll be all right, Hen. I'll be hunky dory when I've had a wee bridey up. Now listen, don't you panic, sweetheart. I don't worry. We'll think of something. But he's on next, oh, mommy. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yay! 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 Yay!
Right, well, now, as, he, as we've got a few minutes in hand before our next guest can be with you, I'd like to do a wee song, because at this time of the year... What? Song, they fond kiss, my love is like a red, red rose. Here's a lovely one now. It's not we'll support you evermore, it's the wedding of Joke Mackay. <laughs> Skipped on the wedding, oh, Mr. Joke Mackay He got married to a little girl, his name was Daily Fly The stone was taken about it, it was quite a swell affair If you listen for a minute, I'll tell you who was there Where the hell are we? I spent weeks scripting this, where the hell are we? It's busking time, boss Busking? What is this busking? I do not bask, the secret of good directing is preparation I do not bask! I know that he was at bald because he had no hair Mistress McPherson, his wife of course was there She round about his very stuck, she thought he packed there There was Alison McAllister and Tapson from the D For it seemed from Aberdeen, under two or three Skelly from Loch Kelly, poor fella he's cross-eyed He couldn't look you straight in the face, the matter if he tried Robin Gray from Stone, we brought Mary of a Kyle Bob McPhee was on his brain, fairly gone his smile All the casualations and the bunker seen a few He's Andy Jane, he's Andy McLean, he's Andy McCarthy too They were young men, old men, girls that weren't men at all Single men, double men, marching to the dining hall What a glorious supper we had there Listen for a minute, I read the bill affair There was pig's head, pig's feet, mocky burden ostriches Ice cream, cold cream, vaseline sausages Blue fish, green fish, fish hooks and partridges Fish balls, snowballs, cannonballs and cartridges Oatmeal, barley meal, porridge and peach rose Rice and taffy, all kind, goodness only knows Pan loaves, pancakes and dumplings galore Apple tarts and rupert tarts and tarts and lovely snow Short bread, brown bread, wheaty bread too Somebody's out at home, ruling in with Irish stew Steak pies, mince pies, kidney pies and pies If you pound a curtain in the curtain punch, you go to prize Port wine, sherry wine, raspberry wine, curtain wine Castor oil, olive oil, lunchy dollar number nine Champagne, real pain, pain, you couldn't tell Lemonade, look as it, medical aid as well Peel, ale, stout, ale and ale and make you swell Lag of beer in masses, beer in baritones as well Soapy water, soapy water, after water too After we had sampled each we were a lively crew The band started playing, when are you gang of all? Bagpipes, gas pipes the pipes and all, we all danced to jig, step the door, step and fling. Join hands together and we all began to sing. Should all the acquaintance be forgot? It's time I was in bed. I never shall forget the day that shot the guy was well. Where are you taking me? Oh, God, I'm not going to stop Almost as entertaining as Auntie Isa's bad leg. And now I'd like to introduce you to a very funny man, uh, one of Scotland's brightest up and coming comedians. Will you give a warm welcome, please, to the one and only Melky Maguire? He's changed his. What's he doing? He's changed his act from rehearsal. It is an act, isn't it? <laughs> He's pretending to be drunk. <laughs> it's brilliant. <laughs> it is an act. Oh no, that's a boy in the slates. The papers will make mincemeat at us. We're going to be able to open a shop with the amount of raspberries we're going to get. I'll leave it to me. One no sunk yet. Come on. I'm a cool with a What's happening? Oh, aye, right. right. <laughs> I'm supposed to be funny, ain't I? Fire <laughs> my Right. Pick your finger. Any finger. Right. Now, I shuffle. <laughs> sorry very much, sorry. Is that funny or what? I didn't pay good money to put up with this. Leave us alone. Uh, what is that? That's no very social, is it? I mean, it's, it's not nice that, is nice it? Hey, I hope all you punters out there are having a better time than this bunch of sewer faces yet. <laughs> this is outrageous. <laughs> Will you please leave at once? Hey, leave me up, will you? There are a couple of million people watching this. Do you know why to be on the telly or something? Bunny, please take me home. I have never been so insulted in my life. Ah, uh, hold up. With a face like that, you must have been. Oh. How dare you? 
and beginning to think you're drunk. Mm -hmm. Huh? Uh, uh, uh. Listen, pal. If I was drunk, you think I'd be able to do this? Hold your cup of water. Yes, I'll get it. Hold your water. What am I going to do? To take away our license? We'll be likely to get a franchise for Kentucky fried chicken! <gasps> Bowl of blanks! Somebody get me out of this! What? <laughs> Who's directing the show? Come in to three and cut to three. <laughs> well, there we are. Improvised comedy at his very best. Thanks very much, Malky. After this, Channel 4 will be your oyster, eh? <laughs> well, for those of you out there who are fans of the great... Here now, honey pie, what is happening? Just trust us, okay? Yes. Our surprise guests are the former Valentines of Variety. Please put your hands together for Jack Mulroy and Mary Lee. Yeah, Mary. Yeah, Mary. Yeah, Mary. Yeah, Mary. Yeah, Mary. Hello there. Hello there. Oh, Mary, she looks lovely, doesn't she? Uh, oh, you really, Mary, you really look lovely. Uh, I'm no bad for 25. That's how she said. Which is he? Watch my boots. I said, I'm no bad for 25. 25? <laughs> You've got your numbers in the wrong way. <laughs> well, listen, Mary, looking back in the old days, remember when I first started winching you? Oh, Mind the winching days. Don't make me sick. <laughs> <laughs> I remember the first night I walked you home to your clothes in Kinning Park oh, in yes, Scotland Street. Yes. Oh, it, was a, it was a welly close. Aye, and my back was against the tyres. I said, oh, I don't aye. fancy this for winching. I was frozen stiff. I mind it. And you said, I know a better place than this. She was in the back of the midden. <laughs> so she took me to the midgey. You mind your own first night sitting oh, in the midgey can? Oh, I'll never forget. Oh, the smell, my oh, God. My God. I didn't know whether it was Mary or the midden, you know. <laughs> <laughs> And that was the first time I kissed you. That was the very first oh, kiss. Uh, oh, what a sugar. Oh, oh Mary. Oh. Oh, oh I wish we, I wish I wish we could recapture these magic moments again. <laughs> you know what we tell you to do? What was that, Mary? That was the hottest kiss I've ever had. I know. I forgot to take the fag out of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> That's stupid. A bottle of rubbish. <laughs> but listen, we've had a marvellous time. Have they have? And we'll always look on the bright side. Well, you could have done yeah. Some things in life are bad, they can really make you mad Other things just make you swear and cuss When you're chewing on life's gristle, don't grumble, give a whistle And this'll help things turn from all the best And to always look on the bright side of life Come on, whistle! Always look on the bright side of life Me a whistle! Me a whistle! Life seems jolly rough, there's something you've forgotten, and that's to laugh and smile and dance and sing. When you're feeling in the tops, don't be silly chops, just brush your lips and whistle, that's the thing. Well, always look on the bright side of life. Come here, whistle, come here, whistle. All of them. Wiggle for the boys. Always look on the bright side of life. Life can be such fun when everything is done. Life's a laugh and death's a joke, it's true. You'll see it's all a show. Keep, Keep them laughing as you go. Just remember that the last love is the new. Oh, 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 always look on the bright side of life. La 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 Oh. Uh -huh.
Jesus, my trust. 